HTML. What's up, y'all? It's your boy JTMM, aka Just Ten More Minutes, aka The Freaking Ten. Um, so I just want to give you a health update, as well as some other news. So first things first, I'm feeling better. Um, you will see that I've got a schedule down there. So before you jump on me, I spaced these recordings out, um, to give myself at minimum a 45 minute break in between. I didn't overexert myself. Um, my head's a lot clearer. My sinuses are a lot clearer. I still can't taste or smell. Um, Exhaustion still hits me, so I do yawn in some of the videos. It's nothing personal. I feel one coming now. Um, but I had to do this for my mental health. Um, to, you know, with, with my wife still being in the hospital, um, knowing that these next two days could be her toughest, even though she's, you know, um, doing okay right now. Uh, it's still a concern, and I needed to get my mind off things. So um, that's why I've put this schedule together. Um, I need to get back into the routine, not only of this, but getting back ready to go back to work full time. Um, that is something that I need to do um, next week. My focus right now, obviously, is on my wife and then myself. But part of getting myself back to 100% is getting myself back mentally, and this is a part of it. So please understand that. I wouldn't do anything that would risk my health. There's too many people depending on me. Um, so just know that and respect that, please. Um, now, on to my wife. Uh, they say that the next two days are kind of her um, crucial time frame to where it could go downhill, um, if it's going to. So that's why she's where she needs to be. But other than that, uh, I've talked to her all throughout the day. Uh, we took her up some stuff earlier. So she's perfectly good. Um, you know, kids are isolating and doing their uh, schoolwork remotely. And then, of course, the, the baby's still with grandma. So... You know, things are looking up for me um, to return back to normal. I'm not going to overexert myself. I'm sitting down. The only time I really get winded is going up and down the stairs. Um, but I do that very sparingly. So don't worry. I'm doing everything I need to. But for this, I really, really, I, and I do mean this, I needed to do this for my mental well-being. Um, so, yeah. I, I yawn, I may cough, as I feel when coming. But just know I pay very, very close attention to my body. If I would have felt like I felt the past couple of days, especially yesterday, mm -mm, I wouldn't have dared attempted this. So, with that being said, my friends, oh, it feels so good to say this. Let's switch it up. All right, guys, so what we've got is a jam-packed day. Again, I space these out. So 8 a.m., we've got Nightwish Sleeping Sun. So um, the reason I picked this one is I was going through the list, and um, I saw this one in Gabriel's list. And I saw this Masters of Rock Festival that I had not seen in any other list. So with that, I was like, you know what? That's a different festival than all the others. It could have been done with the others. It could have been done by previous singers. I don't know. Um, I think I point that out in the song itself because a few things threw me off. Not in a bad way. Um, so that's why I chose that one. The next one. Um, so by now you know... I absolutely love the band Vintersy. Not just their music, but the people themselves are amazing people. Um, so, it, I want to say it was a week ago. 
last Friday, I think it was, and I didn't get to watch it because I wanted to react to it. Um, they did the Metal Injection Slay at Home. And so I, uh, they let me know that the YouTube recording was going out. And so what better way than to cover people that I absolutely just admire creatively and just as people, but have them in that first rotation back. Um, I really hope this, this performance does wonders for him uh, because it was amazing and really truly showed off their talent so I really hope so at 10 a.m. a new band this is one that somebody recommended a while back I didn't forget I had it in the list and it happened to show up in my YouTube recommendations and so I said you know what I don't know if it was the song they recommended but I saw it and I was like I'm gonna grab it and let's go with it. Um, the next song at 11. I got my girl's love bites. That sounded weird. Y'all know what I mean. Um, this one I chose because um, I thought what better way. You know, I don't know what the song's about when I first watched this. Um, but me being, and me starting my channel, the reason I started it was on a crusade truly to change how people look at songs and not just think about the rhythm and the beat and the music side of it, but also the lyrics. And so I saw that and I was like, man, again, coming back, perfect one in the rotation. So don't worry, I'm going to cover all the other ones, but this one really hit for me. The next one, um, I keep going back to this band, and I think it's because I really enjoy her voice. I haven't looked at her name, um, and, and I covered this in the video. I hate to say, but their music is very generic, and they don't do anything to set themselves apart, but it's still good music, and, and I don't mean that as a slam towards them at all. Um, because obviously they're still making music, so they are successful to a point. I just don't hear that next level that takes them to that next level. So, um, but it's still good music, and it's still a good song. In fact, it's a really interesting song for that genre, so definitely give that one a listen. Let me know. The last one. Do you really think I'm going to come back and not have a ginger song? So as I explained in the video, I downloaded, and if uh, if I'm lying, I'm dying. I literally went in, grabbed all of my ginger videos, and um, went through and said, which one have I done an official for, and which one I have done a live. Again, I was sitting down. I was fine. Don't worry. Um, and so I came across Bad Water that I had done the official music video but not the official live so that's what I did so um, as I said I think in a couple of the videos as I go back to normal schedule um, wife being home um, all of the kids being here including the little one and and going back to the nighttime recording I may not release this many um, which I know y'all will say is perfectly fine, and I'm okay with that. I did this one for my mental set, my mental health, um, but I won't overexert myself over the next couple of days, and and that's, you know, y'all have asked that of me. Um, I didn't today. I can say that a million percent. Um, I did have to drive today, so that obviously wore me out. Um, but I did that after these. So um, I'm okay. I'm getting there. But I promise you I will not overexert myself or do anything that's going to harm me, 
to where I would not be available for my family. They are first and foremost, um, especially my wife right now. You know, the little ones, grandma's got her. I talked to her on video chat. The older two, they're teenagers. Enough said. Um, but they're taken care of as well. So everything is under control. And I hope you enjoy these. Um, I hope I didn't come across as a zombie at all on these. I really don't. Um, I did try to put my best into them, given the circumstances. Uh, a lot of these songs that I heard, I absolutely loved. Some of them we've heard before with Vintercy. Um, but for the other ones, man, I enjoyed it. I really did. This, In fact, I, I think I actually got emotional at the end of Love Bites. Because um, that was one of the first ones I did. And it really hit me of how much I enjoy doing this for y'all and for me. So, I'm back um, at the level I can be back. I promise you that. So, don't flood the comments of, you know, don't do this, don't do this. I've got it under control with what I'm doing. I really do. Y'all help me realize of what pace I should do. And I'm really taking that to heart. So I hope you all enjoy this. I will see you all in the comments. I freaking adore each and every one of y'all with your comments. All the viewers, all the subs. Um, y'all have made these dreams come true. And I can only imagine where we're going from here. So before I get too emotional again, I love y'all. I'll see you all in the comments. KTML.